What up, peeps and peepettes? Morbtron here today with more Fortnite Save the World PvE stuff. Uh, and today we're going to be talking about Master Grenadier Ramirez. Yeah, well, I'm actually playing with her as well. Um, so I finally got her level up to level 30, which means that all of her perks are unlocked. Um, so I was very lucky, very fortunate. I got her in an upgrade llama. Um, that uh, just happened to go gold and got a mythic hero out of it. Um, I know a lot of people are a lot less lucky than I am, um, so please don't be salty towards me for being lucky. Um, but yeah, so anyway, um, it's three star, level 30, and she is an absolute powerhouse. Uh, so the first perk she has is Advanced Tactics, which range weapon damage increased by 10%, health increased by 10%. Uh, she gets her frag grenade right away, um, which is just a regular frag grenade. Um, and then it goes over all the bonuses that frag grenade has on it because she's level 30. Uh, she's got debilitating shots, so dealing ranged damage uh, applies one stack of vulnerability. E increasing damage taken from all sources by 5%. Uh, on the target for 15 seconds, and it can stack up to three times, which is cool. Then it's got Rucksack, increase max grenade ammo by three, grenade damage increased by 25%, Go and Commando, which is really good for taking out uh, mist monsters and things like that. Um, basically, pull out a big minigun, mow everything down. Uh, pull the pin, which reduces the cost of grenades by 30, uh, makes them very spammable. Uh, bigger is better, increases the radius of frag grenade uh, damage by 35%. Survivalist, killing an enemy uh, with a ranged weapon, heals a base of 5 health. Don't really notice that too much, to be honest. Um, it, but, I mean, the Master Grenadier Ramirez has so many other good things. It's fine, I guess, having a, a, a perk that's kind of not so great. Um, oh, okay, and then it's got Shockwave, so it's kind of like Ground Pound, you do an AoE... Uh, blast knocks you in the back, does some damage, blah de blah Cluster bomb, this is where it starts to get good. Frag grenade releases six cluster explosions around the impact site that will each deal 20% of the original damage. Um, and then, keep out frag grenade explosions, leave a residual energy field doing 25% of initial grenade blast damage every one, percent, every one second over 10 seconds. Um, very, very mean these grenades are. They do a ton of damage, um, and they're the keep out the big energy field that leave behind um, I believe are even more deadly than the grenade itself. Um, the bonuses that she provides if you have her uh, in your like uh, support squad bonus or tactical squad bonus slots, uh, support squad is increased assault weapon damage by 24% which is pretty good um, and then Survivalist, which is kind of not so good, but, um, meh. Uh, so she's pretty expensive to level up at this point. Um, I need, I need to unlock leveling her up to tier 4, but not too worried about her right now. Um, but yeah. So we're gonna get into a match here, but before I do that, I just want to say that later on tonight at 9pm Central Time, I will be going live on Twitch, uh, playing some Fortnite save the world some shenaniganery um, and you guys if you join in or you, you watch and you have your um, game linked to your twitch account and you watch me you'll actually get a bonus for doing so so the way that you link your twitch account is you go over to uh, you hit start or just get to the main menu you go over to select you go over to live. Oh, I just turned the bright uh, controller sensitivity. Uh, you go over to live streaming, and then you can pair up your Twitch ID with the uh, with the game. And what happens then, as you see here, I have a daily broadcaster quest called "It's an Emergency." So once a day, um, I can go and collect a thing. Um, Usually it's like, go collect some random thing, go open a random loot chest. This one is destroy emergency vehicles for resources. Um, 
and as soon as I destroy two emergency vehicles in a successful mission, I have a timer of four hours. If you watch my stream during that time, when I have that timer going, you will get a quest to go do some random thing, and you'll get uh, some sort of reward for it. Now, I believe it's probably a mini reward llama. Um, if you're just a follower of mine, or you're just watching my stream with that going, but it's a free, it's a free mini llama. Um, if you are a subscriber to me, and uh, you do your quest during um, that timer, you actually get a lot more stuff. So it says, viewers who complete their quests will broadcast a message back to my screen, and subscribers also get an extra reward from their quest. I'm not sure what that extra reward is, um, because obviously I don't get that reward, but... It'd be interesting to see what it is. So if you're a subscriber of mine on Twitch and you do this quest, let me know what you get. So uh, we're going to head into a mission um, and we're going to see what Master Grenadier Ramirez can do. Alright, so we're back and I'm doing a tier 3 um, defend, uh, attack the storm, something or other. Um, it's been a while. It's been the space has uh, been uh, pretty resource heavy to craft. Let's say there we go. Starting now, you've got five seconds to change your the, mind. This is the party zone, apparently. Yeah, this is the party zone. You got um, this, Commander. So we're gonna be able to see. There's a pretty good choke point right here, where we're gonna see Ramirez's grenades do work. So there we go. There's the field that they put in. Let's do that smash for fun times. Nope. Xbox really is not liking uh -oh. how much stuff is on the ground right now, but it's fine. We'll deal with it. Throw another grenade for good measure. Frosty guy doesn't want to die, so I'm, I'm way under leveled for this. But I'm in the game with such with someone that's such high level that. I'm, ge I'm getting 13 bonus levels, so not bad. Not bad at all. But my weapons are not not really up to par right now. For being here, the grenades are doing work. Not possible. Grenade out. But if I have to shoot stuff, it's kind of like last last ditch effort at this point. So, as you can see, the grenades, they, they do a ton of damage. Just a ton. I'm gonna throw another grenade down there, and let's go explore. You kind of see what this base is set up like. So, I mean, these are only temporary, of course, if you, if you haven't... Like, collect... Okay, cool. Collect stuff. Um... So the atlases get put down in random places, and you have to defend against a bunch of a bunch of things coming down. So let's just pop your grenade down there, electrify all those enemies. Uh, let's come back up here. I think there's somebody chewing on a wall. All right, handled. Fuck another grenade. Oh, okay, missed. Grenade out. Bunch of numbers. Good times. Forts taken on husks. Grenade. All right. So this weapon does not do good at long range. It's a weapon from the Halloween event, Fort Nightmares. It's very lackluster, to say the, to say the least. Yeah. Kinda wish I had a different assault rifle that I could use. I have one that I really like to use, but I over-upgraded it, and now I can't make it anymore until I move on to the next area. So, feels bad, man, as far as that goes. Oh, that's a propane guy. That's a propane guy. Ripperoonies those traps. 
But not much you can do there. But it's still a really good choke point for my grenades. That lady needs to die. Another propane guy. And let's take that out. Propane guy. Okay. Oh. A little bit of lag. A little bit. Not okay. Slam, do something. There we go. The game lags every now and then pretty badly. And I think it's not really the game's fault. It's more of the Xbox Live servers that are having so many issues. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm going to try to reset my router so hopefully that doesn't happen tomorrow or should I say later tonight during the stream. And I'm out of ammo. Let's switch to this weapon. Got a bunch of baseball zombies. Look out. Sports under attack. I should say husks. Throw that there. Get electrocuted, zombies. You need to get melted. You need to stop throwing bones at me. You two need to die. Thank you. And where do you think you're going, Husky Husk? Get melted. Let's throw up this turret. Let's heal this dude. There goes more of the traps. Ground slam. Bees. Yep, you can die. Thank you. No. No, thank you. No, thank you. That zombie, shoot this zombie in the face. Uh, our fourth thunder attack. Sorry. All right. Let's repair that. traps. Turn my back for one second. 30 seconds left to go. Well, that's okay. I'm only a couple more seconds to go. Let's just huck as many grenades as we can. Or let's mow these zombies down with the chain gun. Take that. You no longer have a head. There we go. Victory is ours. And dance. Triple threat. Three Atlas victory. There we go. Three Atlas victory. Got platinum badges and everything. Let's see how we did. There we go. 
did pretty good, considering I came in late in this one and I was still on this mission for like a half hour. Forever. But, uh, yeah, the Mythic Ramirez. It's good, good stuff. Good stuff this Mythic Ramirez is. Uh, so if you happen to be lucky enough to get yourself one, or if you feel like spending the money until you get it, some people have. Um, I feel sorry for people that have decided to do that. Oh, oh, there we go. That is level highest chest possible, I believe. So let's see what we get out of that. But yeah, if you happen to stumble into, into one of these things, definitely, definitely give it a go. Um, great hero. Um, does a ton of damage with her grenades. And any ranged weapon, not just assault rifles, so any ranged weapon at all does uh, considerably more damage. Totally worth um, anything. You know, melee weapons kind of suck, but, you know, level 6 loot chest. I've never gotten a level 6 loot chest before. 7,700. Jesus. And mission, alert rewards, sweet. I like drops of rain. Very nice. All right, guys, so that is going to be it for this one. So, like I said, 9 p.m. tonight, that's central time, uh, which is 8 p.m. Um, mountain time, 7 p.m. West Coast time, or 10 p.m. East Coast time. I will be live on Twitch. Link is in the description down below to my Twitch channel, which is just twitch.tv slash morptron. But... That'll be all. So if you like this episode, please leave a like. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. If you have anything to say, do it in the comment section down below. Do not forget to have a good day, everybody, and I'll catch you all next time.